Oh no, not this guy again. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Truth or Consequences, New Mexico. Weighing in at 287 pounds, Dude Love. Here comes the coolest cat in sports entertainment history. You guys remember when Dude Love actually won the tag team titles with Stone Cold Steve Austin? Yeah, and then later almost defeated Austin for the WWE Championship. Can he formulate the perfect plan against the game? The game has arrived. The cerebral assassin ready to engage in warfare. This is gonna be good. And his opponent from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at two Triple H! Over the last decade, we have seen this man's dominance grow. From a blue blood, to a degenerate, to a multiple-time WWE Champion. Indeed, Triple H has solidified himself at the top of the food chain in WWE, and he has no plans on stepping down anytime soon. And I don't think anyone can take him down. Next to Evolution, we have seen Triple H amass power in WWE, cultivating strength in numbers. But there's no more room under the learning tree of the Cerebral Assassin. Now he's all about earning the gold and glory for himself. Indeed, the game has never been more dangerous. One of the many faces of Foley in action tonight. Dude Love might be the most eccentric of his personas, and that's saying a lot. Well, there's something truly inspiring about Dude Love, Michael. This is who Mick wanted to be ever since he was in high school. To see someone achieve that dream has to hit your feelings, even if you're someone like Corey. I agree, Byron. Dude Love is a testament to what is possible when you put your heart into your heart. But let's not forget that Triple H is absolutely no slouch either. The furthest thing from it, even. No doubt in my mind, the Cerebral Assassin already has a strong game plan coming into this matchup. And if it doesn't pan out, I have even less doubts that he'll have a firm plan B, C, D, etc. You can go through the whole alphabet, Corey. There isn't anything the game isn't prepared for. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Yeah, don't let the tie-dye fool you. Dude Love can still pound you. The game getting picked apart here. Dude Love is rolling now, ducking out of trouble. Triple H, such a decorated superstar, Hall of Fame career, has accomplished everything you can in the ring. So, Corey, how do you take down someone as accomplished and well-versed as Triple H? With great difficulty. But the one thing to remember is that due in large part to all that success you just mentioned, Cole, Triple H can get overconfident. And that's something you can manipulate, something you can use to lull Triple H into a false sense of security. So be up shoulders down. The pin doesn't even last to a count of one. Getting that shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. What a headbutt. Vicious. Oh, gosh. Dude Love hyping up the crowd. Saving us from having to sit through that. Knew what 
was coming there. Vicious right forearm. Oh, what a strike to the back. Vicious, downright savage club right there. Dude Love has that determined look on his face. Double underhook. Butterfly DDT. That's it. Dude Love just ended things. Makes the cover. He, no way. No way. Triple H got the shoulder up in the nick of time. Incredible awareness to remain in this matchup. And I think to get the pinfall, you have to try that maneuver one more time. Dude Love had a top rope. Taking flight. Diving body splash. Dude Love just continues to mount the offense. Yeah, Triple H on overconfidence, getting in the way of his game plan, and now he's paying the price for that false sense of security. Some mental chess here from Dude Love. Oof. This match may be nearing its limit. And this is, uh, well, it's not looking good. Oh, Ooh, what a knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. Dude Love with a mandible claw. Look at him go. This is it. Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. How in the world did he kick out? Double underhook. Butterfly DDT. Is it enough to put Triple H away? So was that. tonight. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat.